felt led to keep a diary. A sort of spiritual log for the benefit of others in the future. Couldn't think of anything to put in today. <laughs> Still tomorrow's Sunday. Must be something on Sunday, surely. <laughs> Our church is getting like an auction room. One blink and you get ministered to. Sit still and keep your eyes shining, that's my motto. <laughs> this Sunday was our pastor, Edwin Burlesford's fault. 45 minutes on sin. A record nine lifesaver talks. <laughs> Anne came up to bring me some chicken noodle soup. And just tell me one solitary thing shows God cares about me being ill. He's provided you with a full-time nurse who doesn't ask to be paid and loves you very much. <laughs> Will that do for a start? Great. When does she arrive? <laughs> I found a really good book about faith at the back of the Christian plumbing shelf. <laughs> it's called, What on Earth Are We Doing for Heaven's Sake? <laughs> Clever title. It's all about how Christians ought to be able to move mountains by faith if they're really tuned in to God. I waited until there was no one around. And I, I practiced on a paper clip. <laughs> later on my desk and I stared at it, willing it to move. <laughs> Nothing. Hi, Gerald. <laughs> I was just practicing voice projection. I wasn't feeling Christian forgiveness and goodwill. I'm about to kneel on his chest to make him eat the hedge trimmings. Thank you very much. You know, I could be a really good Christian if other people didn't keep messing it up all the time. <laughs>